Hello and welcome to the demo for the new cookie controller for the GDPR toolkit for OpenCart. So to access the new cookie settings, you go to your admin and then you go to GDPR setting over here on the left hand side, go to GDPR settings. And now we have two new, uh, two new um, tabs here. Okay, so this uh, cookie controller is made in conjunction with the um, well-respected Civi cookie controller and it is made using uh, an API link. Okay, so we have here, just to go down to the settings br for, uh, briefly with you, uh, we to get it to work you need to get an API key. And you get the API key by clicking on this button here and the API is free. Okay, the API is free. There is no charge for this. It is absolutely free. If you want to upgrade to a pro version, you can, but this will work with the free version. Okay, so here we have the status where you can turn on or off the, the, the cookie mechanism. Um, you can decide whether you want it a, a light or a dark th theme. The difference being one is uh, black on white text and the other is white on black text. So uh, it's just whether you that suits your website or not. Uh, the position is whether you want to make it left or right to appear on the left hand side of the website or the right hand side of the website. In here then there are some cookie, there are some settings here. It's important to state that the cookies must be removed from other places you have them on, uh, you have them in OpenCart, be that in the template, either in journal template and settings or hard coded into template files or you have them in the open cart settings you must remove them from there you can only be running one set of uh, analytics because if you run two sets of analytics it means the analytics code will actually will will actually trigger twice on the website and give you bad analytics uh, statistics in regards to bounce rate etc etc on the website so it's really important that you remove your cookies where you have them in other places and you put them in here so here we have the analytics for these are for uh, analytics cookies these are uh, codes to be run when the customer rejects them so in here you'd put in the disable here and you don't include the script script here that's really important you don't include that so when when you go to download these from google uh, your google analytics account they will have script script in it you must not take it okay you must not take it but this is all specified in here again we have here what are the cookies that are acceptable these are the the types of cookies that are being stored this is the default that comes from google okay these are the marketing ones so if you're using marketing um tags like uh, facebook pixels etc there could be other marketing tags you're using like from Rakuten or other places like that you put them in here too okay these are more places for more marketing tags to go in here more marketing and so we've lots of room for them even the add this script that add this um the the share these are the, the cookies that are used that are fired off when there's social sharing on the website okay so this is where they they all get set and then we can actually control absolutely everything that appears in the cookie box so the cookie box that appears will look like this so if i just go to here and i open this over here you will see what the cookie box looks like here by clicking this button here and this is what the cookie box is going to look like so i can turn on or off these settings okay and here it's got the pop-ups in it so it's got the acceptance it's got the links to your privacy policy everything is set up here you can change these settings and this text to whatever you wish it to be okay so it's, it's really really nice and neat and cool because it's just down here and what we were going to do is we're going to introduce whether this box pops up automatically or not or whether the customer has to click it so that's how it actually works um, and I hope it, 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 it satisfies your cookie compliancy. We know that it's GDPR compliant. So thank you very much uh, for your attention and if you have any questions around how to implement this or to set it up, please send your 
questions to support at willowsconsulting.ie. Thank you very much.